Good morning, YouTubers. This is Victoria. Sorry about the TV on in the background. Uh, I hope this is not too dark of a video. I'm going to go get my glucose tolerance to the test today. It's a five-hour test with insulin levels, which means all I can have this morning is a little black coffee, and then they give me a glucose drink, and then I fast for the next five hours while they test my blood sugar levels. So uh, today is Friday, August 1st, 2008, and uh, I won't, of course, be getting this uploaded until uh, Sunday, but I'll make this video in several segments and paste them all together and give you guys all an idea of what having a glucose tolerance test is like. And uh, eventually I will come back uh, probably in a week or so with those results of uh, how the test came out but my doctor's testing me for hypoglycemia to see if my blood sugar goes too low if I go too long without eating. All right, I'll see December you all guys. I'll see you guys. I'm sorry, I'm not awake yet. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. I will uh, see you all in the next segment at the doctor's office. Bye. Okay, here we are at Alameda Town Center, uh, formerly known as South Shore Mall, and we're going to Quest Diagnostics to have my glucose tolerance test done. So this is part two of a series. Here, as you can see, is the building where I will be spending most of the day. So let's go inside and I will uh, be back later. It didn't hurt. Well, because we have a, your physician wants the glucose and the insulin done oh, so together. So two vials every, every time? Oh, mm -hmm. okay. Yeah, no, I want to know what the, because the insulin, like last time I had the two-hour test done, and mm -hmm. the blood sugar was totally normal and did what I expected it to do, but the insulin did things I didn't expect it to do. Oh. It actually came back, my blood sugar was normal, and insulin came back low. Wow. Yeah, which is... I think a good thing. <laughs> so then they give me the drink and then yes, I... Yes, I'm going to give you the drink now. Okay. So you have five minutes to get the drink down. As soon as you're done, you want to let me know because that's the time they felt your hour. And actually, that's going to be 12, 1, 2, 3, 4. So you want to go ahead and get down with that because you'll be here for a total of five hours with us today. Oh, 100? I thought mm -hmm. it was 75 normally. 100. Okay. Everything I read said it was 75. Okay. Alright, here's the drink. I have to drink it in five minutes now, so... Bottoms up. Alright, here I am drinking the drink. This is really sickeningly sweet. Mm. Oh my god, this is horrible. Oh. Oh. This is 100 grams of dextrose. really overly sickeningly sweet. Alright. What are you going to do with the pictures? Oh, um, they're so confined. Yeah, put them all together. Mm -hmm. um, it's actually uh, videos. And put them all together, kind of like a. This is what a five-hour glucose tolerance test is like. <laughs> oh, that doesn't even hurt. Great. Blood draw number two at the one-hour mark.
didn't have any trouble sticking me five times. <laughs> nope, not at all. I've got several places to choose from. And ha about how soon will the results be back? Um, I have to double check what the turnaround time is for a five hour. Press down on here, please. Hello, all you YouTubers. This is Victoria again. Well, I had my first blood draw at 11. Uh, that was the baseline for blood sugar, and then I just had my second one at uh, just past noon now. And uh, my last blood draw will be at 4 o'clock. I'm not feeling very well right now. Um, I'm feeling very tired. I don't do well without breakfast. And the glucose drink didn't really fool my body into thinking I'd eaten much. Um, and my stomach is empty, of course, so I'm really hungry. Um, basically, I just feel really, really tired, like I want to sleep. So hopefully I'll get through this okay, and uh, we'll get the results back. And I've got a packet of cookies for quick energy, which I'm looking forward to, which I will eat at 4 o'clock. So just four more hours. So, yeah, I'm just tired, not feeling real great right now. But hopefully I'll get through this. So, see y'all at the uh, third blood draw at 1 o'clock. Okay, blood draw number three at the two hour mark. Three more hours to go. I'm actually need to turn your arm a little bit. I'm send it. Thank you. Hardly hurts at all. It's always good to hear. Such a small needle. Red Cross uses huge needles. Oh yeah, I've heard. <laughs> and they leave it in for like ten minutes, so oh, it's a long time. And when they take that much blood then you start to feel lightheaded. Yeah, I heard they definitely say eat a full meal before you come. Oh yeah, you do. Hello YouTubers, this is Victoria again on the day of my glucose tolerance test, 5 hour. It is now almost 1.30 so we're about halfway through and I'm really tired and I feel like crap. Um, I don't think I'm hypoglycemic in the sense of the word of my blood sugar getting down to like 40 or anything like that, but I. I don't know, maybe it's just tiredness from not enough sleep all week and now it's Friday. But uh, if I survive this test, I feel like I'm going to be a tired, tired mess of hypoglycemic goo when this is all over. So, halfway through, two and a half hours down, two and a half to go. Uh, let's see, two, three, three more blood draws. So, signing off for now, but hopefully I'll survive.